Hey, what's good YouTube? Welcome to the channel. Today we're unboxing um, a package that I've been waiting for. Wine bottle opener again. Back in business. Opening boxes. This is actually a pre-order for you guys that know. If you're watching this video, you probably pre-ordered this particular footwear, this particular colorway of the shoe. All right, so we just ha have the paperwork, the receipt. And as you open the box, you see it is a nice box from Collegium. This is my first ever Collegium pair. I have to say I've been watching the brand for a while now because they've been out for a while. I always see reviews about the quality being amazing and all that. I have my first pair here. We got some nice, um, just the packaging is so well done. We got this messaging in gold. Um, sprezzatura. All right, so this is a nice box. Again, this is a made in Italy shoe. Yeah, it should be $250 US. When you open the box, you got, you're automatically greeted by the three extra laces. You got black, you got yellow, and you got the cream ones. You got one dust bag. All right, pretty, pretty nice bag. We got the sneaker here. This is the destroyer high i got a size 43 this is the varsity red or as we all know the black toes right off the bat the leather is really nice you also automatically Notice the shape. You can tell they worked a ton of hours and, and went through a ton of samples just getting the shape right. Because, my God, you, go, you don't get that by accident. Look at that toe. Look at that back. That straight, almost straight back with a slight, ever so slight curve right here in the back. You got the Terminator look. You got the Blazer look. Jordan 1 is... The outsole is so, so gummy. I'm sure you guys already know this. This is the same Margom outsole that Rude is using in their, uh, I think they call it the, the replica sneakers. No stamp on the outsole, which is all good. You already know what this is. Stamp on the back. I just wanted to, to unbox this shoe because obviously I've been waiting forever and I wanted to give you like my raw reaction this particular colorway is started off as a friends and family, really limited, and then they opened it. I think, I don't even remember, man. It's 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 just a wild release for these sneakers. But if you got them, you you know it wasn't easy to get. And and this is this is this in particular is they didn't restock it a ton, but they did do a limited pre-order on on this particular. Look at that leather, man. Look at that leather. Super buttery. See how they did this? It's all, um, it's all laced in the back. All leather, obviously made at Collegium. Tag on the insole, made in Italy too. This is really thick, man. This is, this is some bouncy, gummy EVA gel type thing. Look at the inside, bro. Obviously, really good buttery um, leather on the on the lining right here. Leather as well on the tongue, which I'm not a fan of because, like, what about ventilation? But this is a luxury sneaker. Obviously, um, putting the leather on the outside, they wanted they probably went with the look right here, the nylon look, but. They didn't want to sacrifice, you know, they, they wanted to give more. On the inside of the tongue, you have the size in gold, tagged in gold, 43. They fit really nice. You know what the difference is with the smell? They would all smell like leather. And if you buy a Jordan 1, a brand new pair would smell like it just smells like glue. This sneaker right here, that's when you know automatically that it's on a different level. It smells like leather. It smells like a Prada 
loafer is what I'm trying to say. Um, so we can't even really compare it to to the Jordan ones. Like it's a, it's it's a different level. I have like a, a a a different variant of the SL10. This is the SL18 um, with the tassels right here. What I'm trying to say is this is kind of like a Jordan one, right? So you can kind of put the Collegium Pillar Destroyers right next to to these. This sneaker right here is a perfect sneaker. That's that's all I can say about that. If you don't have a pair, um, you're definitely missing out. If you if you're a fan of Jordan ones, if you're a fan of Nike Dunks, if you're a fan of those types of sneakers, they did say that they're throwing in a t-shirt, a free t-shirt for everyone that pre-orders. I'm getting a t-shirt as well on top of all these. Like I paid for this. It just shows you um, the difference in in supporting a smaller, more passionate brand versus a bigger, more established um, brand with passionate people. There's just a slight difference. And what um, I do want to really speak on the quality and the experience on the Collegian pair. I tried them on and they fit like super perfect to me. I'm a size 10, I got a size 10. Now that it's full, it's winter, <laughs> It's weird winter here in Toronto. I can start wearing these and I'm gonna put out a video for sure. Just to share to you guys, um, the if you're planning on getting this sneaker in the future, I just wanted to share with you guys an honest review, an honest opinion on, on this product right here. And right off the bat, I can already tell that this is gonna be a good experience for me. I've been wearing these Chicago's kind of heavily lately. Um, Look at that shape. Look at how things align in the sneaker. It takes heavy, heavy inspiration from the Jordan ones, obviously. But they tweaked it, gave it that insane Italian treatment for $250. The sneakers coming out in 2020 it doesn't reflect the type of year it's been. You have these right here, just taking the sneaker world, uh, or maybe a niche uh, part of the sneaker world by storm. And if you're part of that niche, you're smart. You're a smart man. You gotta put that Italian leather to the test. The only thing about Italian leather is, so when it gets wet, it really absorbs that moisture. That's, that's the only drawback for me. But what you get is creamy, buttery, Italian leather that breaks in beautifully throughout the years and if you've made it this far thank you for watching I appreciate you peace